Mm-mm. Mm-mm, Kenny. Bad form. That's a lot of arrows. Are those bandits still attacking? Way to pay attention there, buddy. Could have been a bandit. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. <laughs> That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. Huh. It's true. So, what did you get? A lot, a of, lot stuff. of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? Uh, we'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. So, you two are uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't bother. Yeah, Doug, calm down. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. Me. I don't think you're capable. In Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily's concerns are valid, you know. Of course you think they are. God damn it, I'm not on anyone's side, Kenny. This is about everyone. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And we always and have to. 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl hmm. came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? She was dead anyway. God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. She really has hung up on the whole murder thing. God, get over it. <sighs> She'll get over She'll it. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Ah, poor Katya. Uh, Caught in day, the middle I with you. Yep, I've just been calling them days lately. Calm down, Doug. I don't know You're getting way too like emotional. It's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now, if she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. <laughs> Goal one. Calm Lily's shit. Oh yeah, I should hey, probably... Hey, you two. Nah. How are you doing? We're okay. 
Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. Adapt How or die. Adapt or die. <sighs> ah, people bother me. Hmm. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. Sounds ominous. About the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. Yeah. Baby. Anything here? Look at Kate. Good job, Lee. Always the informative person. Let's talk to Dave. Hey, Doug. Hiya. What you working on? What are you on? working on? Buddy? I'm just trying to focus on the wall. Anything I'd like to contribute needs batteries or tools I just don't have. I'm tearing down this furniture to patch up the wall. If we go on like this, we'll have half the Travelier piled up out here before we know it. The wall's important. I guess. I feel worthless on watch because I'm not wild about guns and I just wish I was more helpful. Do you feel safe here? Hmm. Safety has always been a bit of an elusive thing for me. I mean at the motel, as opposed to finding somewhere new. I think if we can get whoever is out there to leave us alone, this is a good place to be. And you know, they sort of stopped attacking. Maybe they forgot about us. What do you think about Lily? Dark. I don't know. I guess I'm sad. Nobody deserves to lose their parent like that. You don't think that would make her delusional, do you? I think it could make you anything. Nothing good. I'll catch you later, Doug. Could turn you into a hero that this group needs. Not what it, wait, deserves, not what it needs. Wow. Crap, I forgot the line. Whatever. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Mm -hmm. Let's talk to Ben. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? You feel useful to the group? What? Useful? Yeah, how's your spirit? I'm fine. I'm helping, right? For sure, Ben. <laughs> Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Hmm. Sounds like he's a noob. He's missing stuff. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. Huh. I grew up in Macon. In your face. Oh. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. <laughs> it's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable huh. thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Going. Talk to you later, Ben. Go, going. Bye. Have you heard? Oh, hopscotch! G give me, give me that damn hopscotch. I want that hopscotch. I will see it. Okay, wait. Sounds like Kenny actually has that uh, thing. No, nope, no one cares. I don't believe it when I see it. Hopscotch. Damn it. I got flowers and sunshine. Clearly, Clementine has been doing a good job of keeping this team's morale up. What a peach. Let's go talk to her. If I can walk in straight ish lines. Hey, 
Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. How do you do See, it? See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Yay. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, <laughs> that'd be a good thing to know. What do you think about Doc? He's cool. Cool? He knows things. Yeah. You don't think he seems down? Like sad? Yeah. Everyone is. You? I'm okay. I'll talk to you later, Clem. <laughs> Mustering okay. up a smile. What a... Ah, oh, it's just... Clem! Oh, Clem and Dad! You're just... You're so sweet. Let's open up Lily's doll. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Ooh, is that an option? Hmm. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. You haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've well, been through a trauma, <laughs> and you're not taking care of yourself. Counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. How would you know when you... Okay, this is paranoid. Seems like you're manufacturing this from nothing. Exactly. I'd really appreciate it. 